The father of a former high school hockey player in New Lenox says his son's former teammates bullied and sexually harassed him to the point where he tried to take his own life. And that family has filed a lawsuit now against Providence Catholic High School, some administrators and coaches, as well as the Joliet Diocese. NBC 5's Everard Casme has the story tonight. They did not practice what they preached, to put it very bluntly. That's why Stephen Glink and his clients, a father and underage son, are suing Providence Catholic High School. The lawsuit, filed December 28th, alleges the son was a victim of sexual harassment and bullying by members of the school's hockey team. And it was very pervasive. That was the thing. Um, you know, it just was every day, two or three guys for a long time. According to court documents, hockey players on the team would make comments stating that the son had a nice looking behind, suggest that he touched their genitalia and more. At one point they tried to, somebody tried to put their hands down his pants and they rubbed his backside. Uh, there was, there was name calling, um, blaming him for poor play. The complaint details reports made to the school by the son and parents, including calls to police. In December of 2022, the unidentified student would try unsuccessfully to take his own life. He felt so hopeless and so desperate that was his last resort. The school, hockey coaches, counselors, dean, and president, Father John Merkulis, are among those named in the lawsuit. Father Merkulis released a statement today, which reads in part, we are saddened to learn that a lawsuit was recently filed against Providence by a former student and his father regarding allegations of misconduct related to our hockey program. I wish to assure all in the community that if an investigation reveals that any student is subject to a harassment, Providence will take swift action to ensure it stops and immediately discipline all wrongdoers. But we really think the, the primary responsibility falls on the school and the administration. Do the right thing. The student has since left Providence Catholic High School and now attends public school. The lawsuit is seeking $1 million plus additional fees. Everard Casimir, NBC5 News. Our thanks to Everard.